hopefully, but there is this thing of opposites attract, but hopefully you cho will choose or have chosen someone who's not at the opposite end of the spectrum on child rearing to you because that's really tough to put together. If you have someone who is really strict, you know, has very clear boundaries with the kids, kids are in bed by 8.30, the house is quiet or whatever it is that they are there and you're someone who is, you know, uses the bathroom floor as the laundry basket and the kids are still up at 12 o'clock because that's easier than trying to put them to bed, then you're really going to struggle to put those two together. Um, one of the things that we do when people come to us, and uh, you could try and do this at home too, because uh, it's such a lovely thing to do, is um, in the therapy rooms, we have miniatures, uh, like little tiny toys that you can build a world with, or you can build a scene or a thing. And I give each of the members of the family uh, the miniatures, and they build their picture of how they would like the new family to be. And they get all these, so it's not, uh, you know, it's things that stand for things. So you, they might want a family movie night every week and then they'll put a TV in there to, to show that. Or they really value going for walks and they'll put a row of trees to show that and they build their own picture. And then uh, they kind of let everyone else see their pictures and talk about what their picture is and what they've put in there that's important to them. And uh, then you can have a bit in the middle where they all put bits into what's going to actually be the joint picture of the family. So if movie nights get, get to be voted in, then you put the television in there and if walks get to, and then, but then there are more difficult things. There are like, if people really value quiet and serenity and other people really value music and having the radio on in the background all the time, then those are things that need to be thought about. And whether the radio goes in or out of the picture is quite a big question for everyone. But that little exercise is a really good way of getting to what it is that people value and, uh, and doing it in a way which is quite non-confrontational because you're building your own world. You're not arguing with each other to begin with. You're just saying, this is what's important to me and how can I feed it into the whole family.